measures of precision for ungrouped data. Today, we will be going to discuss about measurements of precision for ungrouped data. There are four kinds of measurements of precision. First, we have media, quartile, decile, and the last one, percentile. But we will only tackle about quartile. Did you know that quartile is the process of dividing the arranged data into four equal parts? To understand more about quartile, I will cite you some examples. First, we have this one. In this data, we have seven numbers. In order to answer the question, the first thing we should gonna do is to arrange the data in ascending order. When you say ascending order, from smallest to biggest number. So in this data, from 3 to 19, from smallest to biggest number. Step 2. Find the median or the quartile 2. After finding the median, when you say median, it is found on the center of the data or in the middle. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. So, our median is 11. 11 is our median. Step 3. Find Q1. Q1 found on the left side of the median. So it is found on the left side of the median. So 1, 2, 1, 2. So 5 is our Q1. While Q3, or the step 4, it is found on the right side of the median. So 1, 2, 1, 2. So our Q3 is 13. So it's done. Q2 or Q1 rather is 5. Our Q2 is 11 and our Q3 is 13. So do you have any questions guys? Yes. What if, if the total number of the given data is an even number? How can we find Q1, Q2, and Q3? Very good question. When the total number of the data is an even number, it is quite difficult or complicated. When you say even number, it is divisible by 2, like 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, and so on and so forth. Example. As I mentioned a while ago, step 1 is to arrange the data in ascending order. So from 4 to 22, from smallest to biggest number. So after that, find Q1. Or Q2 rather. Or Q2 is 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. So the, there are two numbers in our median. 9 plus 9 is equals to 18. Divided by 2 is equals to 2. So that is our median. In finding Q1, so 1, 2, 1, 2. Our Q1 is 4. And our Q3 is 1, 2, 1, 2, 13. So that's it. I hope you learned something about my discussion. Thanks for watching, guys.